We'll make this rule. If I beat him, that means girls are better than boys. And if he beats me, he was on the best horse. <laughs> I didn't even know that I drew, but she's, a, she's in big trouble. Speed on the rail. Oh. Gotta love it. Gotta Home love team. It. Oh, yeah, this wasn't organized, was it? <laughs> Like I said, if you lose, you, you know, there's, I'm sure there's a moment where you're just like, ugh, oh, I lost. And there's just no words to describe how terrible it is. Um, but at the same time, it's just fun and you try to, you know, if you win, you're like, ha I won. And if you lose, you'd say, oh, it's no big deal anyway. It doesn't mean anything. No big deal. Okay, five for good luck there. Lucky five with a busy out there, Richard. He scared of me. See, Richard, he scared of you. Great match, though. Between Gary Stevens and Julie Crone underway, they broke in a perfect pair. Richard of England's keeping busy banana company going into the first turn. Gary Stevens just sitting snug here on Busy Banana at the rail, but Richard of England, Julie Crone also just got him on a long rein on the outside. Julie Crone still just sitting snug though on Richard of England. Now she draws the stick though, and Julie Crone's in trouble. She's had a go for the stick on Richard of England. Busy Banana now a quarter of a mile to go, and he's only a length and a half in front. It's gonna come down to a grueling stretch run. Julie Crone riding for her life on Richard of England, but Gary Stevens is getting that little bit extra out of Busy Banana. And Gary Stevens... Happy match. It was okay to finish second to Gary, I guess, but I'd rather win. <laughs> but it was fun. <laughs> They're gonna be so confused.